Well, I interrupt my time away to make an announcement. After conferring with uh, our staff, and I believe uh, one of our staff members has talked with uh, a local physician who's aware of all these issues, uh, we are going to make some changes to our protocols. Uh, you see this mask. Now before you freak out and think, I don't wanna wear a mask, I'm not wearing a mask, we're not going to make them mandatory, but we are going to highly recommend that people wear them. Now you may not need to wear it the whole time you're in the church, but when you're in close proximity of people, I would encourage that. You say, why now? Well, you've seen the numbers. Uh, the COVID virus with the Delta variant is spiking like crazy in our state. It also uh, is spiking in our county. More than 300 cases when I checked the newspaper this morning. In fact, I don't think we had that many cases at one time in Garland County throughout the course of the pandemic when it got started and in the other surges. So it's a deal, it's real, and it's causing a lot of problem, especially for people who haven't had vaccinations. But because even some of those who've had vaccinations have contracted the virus, though thankfully lesser cases, lesser, lesser serious cases, uh, it's out there, and so we need to love one another and uh, protect one another. So we're going to recommend that when you're in the church, when you're in close proximity with people, that you put on a mask. I mean, you do uh, whatever you think is best, the distancing, the touching. might want to back off a little bit from, uh, from hugs for a little while until this thing gets under control. Uh, so we're not going to enforce like we did uh, throughout most of the pandemic since we've relaxed our protocols, but we do want to highly recommend that when you're in close proximity with people, uh, whether it's in the sanctuary, but especially in connect group settings, because we've had some spread in through a connect group setting, I encourage you to, uh, to wear a mask. You know, I, I, I said it won't be forever. It feels like forever, but surely one of these days this thing's going to be done. If you haven't gotten your vaccination, I'd encourage you uh, to go get that vaccination. You'll be taking better care of yourself and perhaps protecting others that you love. But in the meantime, let's, uh, let's put the mask back on, especially when we're in close proximity to people.